What's up guys, it's Scott and Tyler Heineman here. Uh, we're just gonna take you through a day in the life of uh, what we do in, in the off season. We're gonna go to our workout right now at uh, Proactive, so we gotta get the uh, gym lift on before we go hit and throw and do all that stuff. We're at our workout spot, Proactive. Starting the day off with a nice workout, get the body going. You gotta keep the body in shape in the off season. Most important thing, keep it healthy, keep it ready to go. The baseball crew! Yeah, I'm signing my Easton deal today at five. The biggest thing to me for the off season is to just dominate it the only way I know how. I mean, uh, you know that other people are working and everyone's always competing. So everyone, if you have a job, everyone wants your job. Uh, if you're competing for a job, you're always working. So, you know, once you know you complete an off season, you go into the season and you see the work that you put in paying off, it only makes you hungrier for once that season ends, the next off season, you know you gotta put in the same work even more and you're gonna get the results that you want uh, when season comes around. That's it for the workout. Now we're headed to the cages. Got to get our swings in. Get it going. I love bicep curls, man. Right? More bicep curls than I've seen. Just finished our workout at Proactive. Now we're showing up to the Easton Hit Lab. This is our spot. Uh, I'm a client with Easton, so love to show up and, and hit here. Great facility. Uh, you'll see when we get inside. A lot of guys come and get some swings in. Uh, it's a nice indoor facility. Arms are toast after the workout, now I'm like I did. I'm a perfectionist, and so knowing that I'm not perfect and my swing's not perfect uh, and there's work to be done, it can be tough for me to you know, be in the, the cage and know that there's things that I need to do and they don't click immediately, so I know they don't happen overnight and I want them to. I think that's what I embrace the most is uh, the fact that you know this isn't an overnight thing. Uh, you know, you've been working your whole life and you've been getting better each day for you know however many years I've been playing. Just knowing all the work you're putting in, hopefully you get an opportunity and it pays off. I think uh, you know that's going to be the best feeling. You're an all-star. Yeah, awesome. That'd be awesome. Oh yeah. Break down one. Nice job, game winner. Yes! Yeah. So we just finished up at the Hit Lab. Uh, we're gonna go eat now. My brother's complaining, he's starving, so uh, gotta feed the body, and then uh, we're gonna hit up the YMCA and do some of our defensive work, uh, play some catch, uh, and then that should be it. I mean, I like cooking. I enjoy cooking. I enjoy knowing what what's going into my body, as opposed to you know, not knowing certain additives that are put in. But for me, I'm a simple guy, I just like, I could eat the same thing every day, uh, as long as it's good and it's healthy and I like it, but um, you know, these guys are mixing it up, you know, creating things, and I just want it to be simple. <laughs> just throwing all sorts of stuff in there. Yeah, so you're just, supposed to have flavor, just like you do at a restaurant. You do at a restaurant, you don't get a plain slab of meat. Yeah. It's done up with stuff. You can always add to it after, but you can't take away. Just eat with love. My Easton glove, ready to go. Me being the younger brother, uh, with my brother uh, kind of leading the way was huge, just because everything that I was gonna go through, he had already been through, so uh, he was able to talk to me about it. To have someone kind of telling you, you know, what's gonna take place before it happens, uh, it just made me feel very prepared. Just having someone always available and uh, chasing the same goals you are, you can't, you know, you can't, it's, it's, it's hard to explain how, how great that is. We always check up on each other's stats and stuff like that. And um, we don't just look at the box score, we look at the summaries because sometimes, you know, you can go for four, but if you just check the box score, you go for four and that's it. But if you check the summaries, you could have a good day with a few line outs or something like that. And so, we know when to talk and we know when to give each other space. Anytime I FaceTime him, just seeing his face puts a smile on mine. It makes me laugh, so. <laughs> yeah, <all> right. <laughs> Started the trek at 8 a.m., yeah. So, it's a good six hour day. 
said. Oh. Done deal. All right, that's our day. Uh, good day's work. Got to give a big shout out to Easton uh, for helping us out. And uh, thank you guys for joining us, man. It was a fun day. Uh, you got to sneak peek a little about what we do on a daily basis. And now we go take care of these puppies right here. But that's all we got. Hey, come on. That's a wrap.